was sick and dying, and her only wish was to help others. 11 year old Natalia Marsh Welton died from a brain tumor last week, but tonight her family's hoping her mission and her message live on. Allison Montoya has the story you will see only on WLWT. Kelly Marsh Welton couldn't be prouder of her daughter Natalia, who used her wish from the Make a Wish Foundation to give out blankets and soup to the homeless. To have a kid at that age that's just so full of love for other people that she gets excited about helping and, and volunteering, that's all a mom can really ask for. Sadly, 11 year old Natalia lost her battle last Wednesday as she had an inoperable brain tumor. I know everybody misses her because of the good things she has done when she was still alive. Natalia's younger brother, Malachi, knows his sister had a big heart. However, her father, Byron, didn't know just how far his daughter's kindness would spread. Even overseas, you know, we. Got some information about somebody doing it overseas, and it was like we did not realize how big this was going to be. Natalia has collected more than 600 blankets and even found the strength to head back to the drop in center for her birthday last month. I hope that uh, people use her as an inspiration. Maybe it won't be soup and blankets, maybe it'll be. Um, you know, care packages for soldiers or toys mm -hmm. for kids. Certainly, what an inspiration for all of us. Now, Natalia's family also tells me that donations of blankets keep pouring in and that they will always visit a homeless shelter on her birthday in October. Reporting live, Allison Montoya, WLWT News 5. Allison, thank you. Natalia's mother said that after her treatment, she often felt cold, and that's when she got this idea to help the homeless. She said that she wanted to warm people from the inside out with blankets and soup.